join me in exile, Featherless One? For the change of pace. Court gets so noisy. Here, I'm the only one squawking. And I get the choice bits from the fish that wash up on the shore. As close to fish as you can get in this place. Memories of fish, I guess. Remember that nothing here is real. I guess that means you're talking to yourself, Featherless One. You're in oblivion! Nothing is ever quite what it seems, and you shouldn't let your eyes betray you. If they do, pluck them out and give them to me. Eyes are so delicious. So temperamental.
Think twice before you cross. Have you returned with the wayward relic? Curious. This doesn't seem so strange at all. It's almost... comforting to look at. Right. Can't let my guard down. I'll have it crated up immediately. The Order thanks you for your assistance, Adept. There may be more relics you can recover for us soon enough. Check with me tomorrow. I may have something for you. One of the Mad God's rituals to summon Daedra requires a ceremonial cheese knife. To our chagrin, we recently learned this is a specific relic. The Order tracked one to the Forgotten Crypts in Deshan. Recover it before it draws the attention of the Temple in Mournhold. Ah, there you are. Welcome, Adept. I've deciphered the spell inside the book. Are you prepared for Sheogorath's first test? Excellent. It's been fascinating to work with Shalador. Even though he can't read the book, he's been an invaluable resource. I had to decipher layers upon layers of meaning hidden within the tome. Yes, speak with the Archmage. He's meditating on the challenges ahead. I'm still somewhat drained from my effort, so he'll open the portals to the Shivering Isles for you. Auriel, watch your steps. I'm very excited about this project. Chalador's Sanctuary would be a boon to every mage in Tamriel. Even Guildmaster Vanus approves of our work here. I'm so glad you asked. On the surface, it's a simple book of nursery stories from the Dunmerland of Stonefalls. But that's just on the surface. So much more. Each story has hidden meanings, clever references to arcane lore, twisting and turning into the depths of history. It was fascinating to fully unlock the secrets of the book. Sheogorath may be a madman, but he's also a genius. Not much. We tried to scry into oblivion to get a sense of the place. I couldn't see anything, but I was swept up in a strong sense of homesickness. 
I came of age where most High Elves do, the beautiful green shores of the Somerset Isles. I often think of the pink petals and soft breezes of my own land. I'm not sure why those memories return to me today, though. Of course, Adept. While investigating some ruins for me, you caught the notice of Archmage Shalador, ancient patron of mages everywhere. We're working with him to complete the Mad God Sheagorath's trials and recover Shalador's lost sanctuary. A genuine pleasure. He has a fascinating view of history from a first-hand perspective, and his knowledge of the deeper mysteries is, well, I feel like an apprentice again. Adept, what transpires between myself and the Archmagus is between us and no one else. I don't need to answer your questions or anyone else's. I'm so glad you asked. On you read my letter? Oh, I'm so grateful you've come. We found something powerful. A, a Daedric... Wait! What's happening? Artifact would get us killed. I warned them, warned all of them, but they wouldn't listen. They never listen. I've got to find the others. There's still time to save them. Has to be something very dangerous. But that can wait. My friends are in danger and don't even see it. Some scryers, huh? A Daber's in Shornhelm, and when Riddle is in Marbrook, Milo's in Stormholt, maybe. Yes, yes, he must be there. I just hope we're not too late. Thanks for the help. Got any questions? Let's just make it quick, all right? My friends can't very well outrun their own shadows. Bonifred of Clan Owlcloak. Skaldia and I came up together in Riften, under Magus Auriella. He was always the sharper blade. Magic came easily for him. Me? Not so much. Got too much frost in my blood. Still... I can hold my own. It just takes me a while. Unfortunately, Skaldia's not the only mage who's been killed by his own shadow. He's just the most recent. Other members of our order have been turning up dead all over Tamriel. I hurried here to warn him, but I wasn't fast enough. Oh, Shaw's bones, you really want to know, huh? Fine. My associates and I are all junior scryers in the Order of the Eye. We scoured the tombs and ruins of Tamriel, looking for extra planar threats, rifts in the Vale, Daedric artifacts, that sort of thing. We've had visions of a Daedric artifact. At least we think it's a Daedric artifact. It's hazy, you know, obscured by something like frosted glass. Sorry, Skaldia was always the wordsmith. A mage can't afford to be sure of anything, but I'd bet my family's meadery on it. Daedric artifacts grant untold power to those that carry them, but always at a cost. The Mages Guild can't let even one of these things fall into the wrong hands. Are the Junior Scryers in the Order of the Eye? It was just Skaldia and me at first, but others caught on eventually. We started writing each other once we realized we'd all stumbled upon the same artifact. <laughs> Thought we could find it all on our own. You think I haven't tried? I sent projections, but this doesn't come easily for me. Uh, magic, I mean. Anyway, I have to warn High King Yorin first. I heard that his rune galder has been looking into the artifact as well. Please, just find my friends. 